first question on your right. Fellas over here, just just wanted to know what you feel like was the difference tonight. Why the game turned out the way it did? You feel? Um, it felt a little on and off. Um, you know, we was playing hard in some spurts, and you know, uh, when it got to a point where you know we still in this thing in the long stretch of the game, we you know we kind of picked it back up. But you know, games like this, you can't really take no players off. Kill, just a, a quick follow. You guys got it down to one. What do you feel like was the key in getting that? Because they were up 14 in the fourth and got down to one. What was the key or keys to getting it down to that close? Just playing our way. We were just defending, finding each other. We were just playing sons basketball. Gina? For both you guys, here. Uh, just after the really hot start in the first quarter, just what do you feel like shifted maybe in the second to let them kind of get back in the game and, and take the lead? We just made it easy for them. We wasn't... We we left uh took our foot off the gas and you know credit to them uh, they stayed poised they we made that run they didn't react they just stayed with it and took the lead but we relaxed and you know that's what hurt us. Over the right side, hey for either of you, you know it wasn't the entire game obviously but it seemed like there was a lot of possessions especially when things were going bad where everyone was just kind of waiting for Devin to do something you know that the offense kind of got stagnant. What, what did you see out there? How tough has it been to get into the point five kind of offense and had the Bucks done something to kind of disrupt that, I guess? Um, they, they done it. They, they're doing a great job. Just you no know, garden. Uh, they got couple, they got guys out there that can guard and um, just making it tough. Um, speed us up sometimes and they just credit to them. They're doing a great job. Anthony here. Yeah, the game kind of ended on that offensive rebound on the on the honest free throw late. Just from your perspective, how did that ball kind of bounce to them? That was a horrible miss. You know, um, it's just a athletic play. You know, he tipped it behind him, knowing that his teammates are there. It's a bad miss. Dave up front, Mikael, It's been uh, right, probably it's been almost six months since you guys lost three in a row as a team. <laughs> Obviously, that hasn't been what you guys have been about. What's it going to take, and I guess for both of you, uh, DeAndre, too, what's going to take uh, not to make it four? <laughs> Everything. Um, you know, just being relentless, man. We can't really, you know, shy away from what really got us here. We just have to stay consistent, man. And we just have to regroup and, you know, just make sure we keen on togetherness when, you know, things don't go our way. Playing again on the right. Just seeing how Chris and Devin came in and seeing you two guys now, I sense a already focus of, okay, we got to get this game six. What was maybe, I don't, you don't need to discuss what exactly was said in the locker room, but what was the move like in the locker room? Was that already fast forward into Milwaukee or were guys still bothered by what happened tonight? Um, we ready, man. We ready for the next game. Um, you, you're going to, if you soak about it, it's, the blink of eyes, she's gonna be over. So mm -hmm. we'll we'll learn from it. Um coach gonna show clips and you know what we have to do better, but we know what we have to do. But we ready, man. It's just do or die. We lose, it's over. So we gotta go out there and play our way and, and go get game six. Yeah, I like it. You know, tables are turned now. Now we're the desperate team. Um, you know, we had our chances of being up and you know, trying to finish the job now. We're in the same position that they were in. They're up and now we gotta go get it. That's why it's a little bit more fun. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you.